Hi, I'm Ron Heinlein, and I'm the president and owner of DTF Company. And I want to introduce you to one of our styles, but I also want to do this first. I want to take the insert that's in it, see if there's any spacers in it, and there happens to be two of them, and we'll talk about this in just a few minutes. Okay, let's talk about the 9108, and we also make this in the 9106 that's a tie. <coughs> This is a shoe that actually originated, started our whole company in most cases. One of the deepest women's shoes in the shoe business is this is a woman's shoe. And it's got one of the thickest, the tallest toe boxes in the country, has the highest girth in, <coughs> in the country, has the deepest counter in the country because of people that just want a little bit dressier type of shoe but need the width. Go to seven E's in this particular shoe, <coughs> five E's. We, <coughs> excuse me, we can make this in a 9E, 10E, or 14E as well. Okay, and that'll be in the special order section. All leather, uh, uh, all Napa leather, all leather line, so you have the breathability, the flexibility with that. And leather is only found in better shoes all over the country. And everybody who knows shoe business knows that. Padded tongue has four ply counter. And that means four wraps of leather in the back that gives you better substantial support. It's a three to one combination. That means it's three widths narrower in the heel than this, and that's normal in most all our women's shoes because your heel in a woman is just a lot more contour than a men's, and you need the four flex or the forefront support, but you need the tightness in there, so we do a three to one. Extensions on the bottoms, and that means on a 7E, e, it's on an 8E e bottom. If it's a 5E, e, it's on a 6E e bottom, and the purpose of that is to give, first of all, to give you a little more wiggle room in your toes, but also give you where there is foundation, <clears throat> and you have the wider wrist, you're not hanging over. Okay, has the strongest midsection and reinforced, and I can't break that, impossible to break that, heel counter in the country, and I get a quest this all the time. Ron, what do I need a strong midsection and a heel support? Why do I need that? We want to cut out the bilateral movement. <coughs> I love these tennis shoes and I love, <coughs> excuse me, these comfort shoes that you can bend like a pretzel. They're moving this way as well as the four flex. The four flex is very common from that point. What we want to do is cut that out completely. If this is a normal casual shoe, a comfort shoe, it <coughs> turn. Um, you would find that you walk two and a half miles, you would put two and a half miles to four miles of wear and tear on your foot. We <coughs> cut that out completely. If you walk two and a half miles in this, you only put two and a half miles of wear and tear. Uh, you don't double the wear and tear in the at when we get older. And right now, I can't. I'm losing my voice a little bit. Excuse me is that I, I know I wear and tear multiplies a great deal more so than when I was 20 from that. So that's the purpose of that. Okay, and to, what else to make it more comfortable and is the insert as you see it. I took it out. Great insert. It's a plasticode insert that has a great raised arch to it, great cradle heel, great T-bar to it, and you get three of those free from us every four months especially if you wear the shoes all the time you throw this away and you put this in now when you get this you take those two out you put that in main purpose is, is to give you more room if you and this is what we call a filler or a spacer or a thin insert if this happens to be a little still a little too tight take that out and put your spacer in here and wear them for three or four weeks break the shoe in and then take that out and put your insert back in. Main reason for the video is I don't want you to put a spacer on top of it. it on your insert, it goes underneath, okay? The reason why we developed this is that there is a foot discrepancy in many women and men, and we need to tighten up the left or right. You got the left or right here. It can go either way, and in turn, it goes underneath. You can tighten them. You can adjust this as much as you want in almost all our shoes. As long as it has a removable footbed, we will provide you with an insert. Might be one one set, two or three, it depends on which supplier we happen to be, we need for your particular situation on your foot. 